And in the newsletter, I kind of just laid it out very simply that if we get this rejection with ARC, I think we're heading into the buy zone. And if it's a really uh, massive rejection, we're going into the, the 27 um, uh, for that sort of the buy up of liquidity. Um, but most broadly, I don't know if I would be, I mean, I'd be very keen at these levels. I have alerts set. I'd be nibbling and buying in those areas, almost like, yes, please. Um, but if you want to be patient, just wait. You can wait for 30,400. Until we get above that and find that support, when you know we're on top of this huge volume area, we're back on top of, see these wicks going up into this 30,400. We're back on top of the 20. Just in this area for here, we're going higher. So you could just wait and buy then for confirmation. Otherwise, you can just buy the value as it comes down. Uh, something as well, I wanted to just bring everyone's attention. I'm massive on looking at the monthly chart uh, for that big picture. Absolutely love. But if we have um, a look where Bitcoin is sitting, it is finally and almost stealthily managed to get on top of the 20 moving average on the monthly. The average has actually fallen beneath that and we're on top of it. This is, a, this is huge. Uh, you know, once every time we're above it, we're essentially uh, either starting or in an uptrending bull market over a, a longer period of time. So um, this gives me a lot of pause that once we've done this little bit of, you know, just grinding here, grab the liquidity at support, we are going higher and we're going higher hard.